right guys, we will be taking you this week through Deep Week in Bali. Um, Cohort's heading there for one week. Yeah, Ahmed is three hours north of Denpasar, northeast. Um, we're heading out with about 100 athletes for free diving. Adam Stearns take us on for the night. We'll be coaching for 30 minutes each day, um, body weight stuff, mainly calisthenics and sandbag work, so sort of boot campy. Uh, the guys are pretty diligent with their self-care. They don't drink over this period. Obviously, they're doing deep diving. Um, they do a lot of yoga and meditation, a heap of stretching. Pretty much all day, they'll go through different breathing exercises, diving practices, and pool sessions. And then they'll come back in the afternoon and do a bit of training with us. We'll see you in Bali. Hey guys, welcome, we've, uh, we've made it to Bali. Today is day two. We spent the day yesterday uh, getting to know everyone, hang out with the level one crew for their certificates for free diving. So they do level one, two, and three. So Sophie and I sat down with the level one groups and uh, yeah, did a bit of that stuff, which was cool. Learned about breathing. We went down to the beach, we filled up all our sandbags, ready for our day one strength conditioning with cohort. We did a little EMOM after a bit of a yoga warm up. We've only got about half an hour to sort of play with before meditation. Uh, today we're going to go back and get some more because we were packed house so a full house and uh, fill up some more sandbags. A bit of partner carry work today, a bit of sandbag up the hills and a bit of fun stuff up in the yoga sala too, so uh, we'll see you there. Legends, just finished training, so for now she's in the pool having a swim, just here behind the, behind the training set. This is our little gym for the week. We always say we're not going to train when we go away and then we do two days of no exercise and we get uh, a bit stir crazy. Just did a modified Cindy for myself, a 20 minute MRAP and Soph did, what did you do? 20 minute MRAP, uh, bungee and 35 deadlifts. There's the deadlifts. Get them, babe. Ooh. We also got to train these guys this afternoon, so it's nice to try some of the gear out that we're doing. Uh, the lunges, especially with the sandbags and all the sandbag work, because we haven't done much of that ourselves, and we've got a lot of that program for this week. But yeah, we'll, uh, we'll send you a video of the guys hitting it this afternoon. talk with the freedivers on the principles of strength. As you can see, it's fairly warm up in here. We look like Ollie after his, uh, after his talk. We uh, went through the importance of strength training for athletes and general population. The importance of squatting, hinging, pulling and pushing, not increasing the musculature or muscle mass around the chest cavity to increase oxygen um, saturation through the lung capacity. Went through a base strength cycle for Adam, uh, the rep range, uh, the style of lifts, the accessory work, which moves elicit greatest hormonal response, which moves increased hip and range capacity and functionality. And we went through hypertrophy and the benefits of accessory work for injury prevention. Went for about one hour, we had about, I don't know, maybe 15, 20. And so I've got a talk coming up in the next couple of days. Uh, Thank Legends, I've got the man himself here. <laughs> uh, what have we been up to today, Ads? Mate, we've been uh, doing workshops, diving deep, having fun, and just enjoying the tropics. And whereabouts are we? We're at Abnista. We are, this is the, yeah, this is the Abnista. Yeah, this is where it all, it's all happening. Just a uh, tough day at the office for the two boys. Yeah, man. Have a little smile. Okay. Hey, guys, <laughs> I've got a dragon fruit here, rich in colour. It gets its colour by polyphenols high antioxidants and really good for anti-inflammatory and very hard to get quality fruit this colour in Australia, so get on your fruits. <laughs> the 
<laughs> oh, I got it on film. <laughs> Me doing, babe? Yeah, good time. Just finished yoga, heading up to this nice little spa now. Gonna go uh, to the gym here. It's called the Gria. Looks delicious. Get it. Get it. Long time so Legends, we're here with Sherwin. Sherwin's currently in Jeddah um, as ex Fizz. We've got him here today working with Soph. She's got a little bit of uh, lower back pain. Uh, Sherwin, give us your three best tips for uh, looking after that lower back, mate. Yeah, so in my experience, the biggest things that people can do to keep lower back pain away or to remedy it if they've already got it is to make sure we get some really nice deep stretches in glute med and glute max. Uh, secondly, stretching piriformis, really, really big uh, cause of lower back pain and that sciatica sensation. And then the last one is hip flexors. Number one, number one cause for lower back pain in my experience is those tight hip flexors, iliosoas. Make sure you stretch them out. spasms throughout the day, it's more likely to be uh, potassium based or dehydration. Um, when you have like constant ache, uh, something that's just like a vice grip on a muscle, that tends to be happening. Lunch time! Get it. Yeah. What's happening Adam? Are you good mate? I still have massage. Perfect guy. <laughs> Alright guys, we have uh, Soph doing her talk in the classroom behind me. Um, her talk today is on the biochemistry of hormones and training. Just keep you updated. She's blowing their minds. Finished, tell the go so. Good. How many Fun. people in there? Fair few. What did we talk about? Hormones, training, erythropoiesis. Lovely. And otherwise, all you do is just pull it, literally pull it to the chest. Let's talk about it. Yes. Yes. Get it. Drinking bird. That's it. Alright guys, that's it for us from Deep Week. Thanks for following us uh, the last week on our journey. Hope you've uh, got a better insight into what we do over here with the freedivers and Adam. And uh, we'll see you all very soon.